Ooh, rightio, where are we? Oh my god, I always forget, it's, uh, if you AFK, the world is still ticking away in the background, isn't it? <sighs> oh god, it's all the way back around, look. <laughs> there is a load of copper there. Alright, see ya. Take care, Cal. Hope you have a top night, mate. Happy birthday to your bro. Yesterday was your half birthday. <laughs> you celebrate your six monthly uh, interim periods, do you, photo? Is that an excuse to get bladded? Like your 32 and 6 months? Time to celebrate. Alright, that's don't know that's going anywhere. Oh shit. Well that works out alright actually. So I th I think to be honest I've got a fundamental issue with the game now, and that is that the game is far too pixel dependent. Because that's all I've been doing now is trying to gather pixels, and there doesn't seem to be an efficient way of doing it. If I use the refinery, I mean, do I need iron again now? Now that I'm kind of on gold tier, do you think if I just went and the problem is I've converted it all to bloody bars now, haven't I? Do you know what I mean? Ah. See, I was saying earlier about what I must start doing is getting in the habit of uh, converting my ore to ingots every time I go back to the ship. But to be honest, that, that might be the last thing you want to do. Because you could, the refinery can only convert ore to pixels. So what I could end up with is like fight. Oh, hang on a sec. Sorry, what I could end up with is a situation where I've got 500 iron ingots that are of absolutely no use to me. Ah, Mr. Stabby. Oh, that's cool to know. So I can use bars in the refinery as well. And does that work comparatively as well? Because obviously it takes... Let me just get a light up. It takes, for example, two iron ore to make one iron bar. One iron ore gives me 10 pixels. So does one iron bar give me 20 pixels? Is it a direct comparison? Uh, we'll give you the benefit of the doubt there, photo. Oh, I reckon it's just another excuse to have a beer, mate. But I'll be honest, you don't really need an excuse to have a beer, do you? <laughs> do you drink every day, photo? Uh, you know, not as in being nosy, just intrigued. Like, do you have like a beer at least each day? Or do you only drink at like the weekend? Yeah, well, bars are worth twice as much as all. Yeah, got you. Oh, that's good to know. Thanks for that, Stabby. I was thinking I might have made a real bugger there. I mean, in your opinion, Stabby, because you seem to know quite a lot about the game, would you say the game is designed for me at this point? Jesus, look at that, man. For me to actually be using my ore to get pixels. Because I'll be honest, this is getting a bit monotonous now. I don't feel like I'm able to progress at any sort of reasonable rate because I'm completely pixel bound. You know, I can upgrade my gold pickaxe. Oh no, I can't yet, can I? Because I need platinum. I've, one, I've not found any platinum. So I'm guessing that's something I need to sort out now I'm in gamma sector. But to make my gold armor, which is what I need for this planet, I'm assuming. And I mean, I've still got steel, is that? Still spears and hunting bows to so upgrade those again. I need pixels, but you just don't get them.
You turned a lot of bars into pixels, right, mate? Okay, buddy. I think that's going to have to be the way to go then. I'll do a bit of mining here. See if we can find any platinum. You saw I had like 500 copper ore, yeah. You won't need copper anymore to make it into pixels. Right, cheers, Stammy. That's awesome. I really appreciate the uh, tips here, mate. Again, it's, it's like I was saying earlier, I'm a bit of a hoarder, you know. I, I always, I, I think sometimes it actually means that I don't enjoy games as much as I possibly should do. Because I always worry, do you know, if I use all my copper now, blah, 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 you know, am I going to regret it later on? And, you know, sometimes you just got to say, well, sod it, let's go for it. It was a big problem with me playing Skyrim. I was forever going back. I had a mod where you couldn't fast travel. Um, and frostbite and things like that running. So it's kind of like semi-realistic travelling. And of course, every time I went to a bloody dungeon, I'd pick up so much crap that I knew I could sell at a good price. It, you know, I'd be in the dungeon maybe for an hour, and then spend the sort of like seven hours <laughs> trekking backwards and forwards, trying to maximise my profits. And, you know, it's I think that OCD kicks in. Oh, shit. Don't come after me, boogie woogie. Good shot, mate. Good shot. I want a gun. I want one of these guns everyone keeps telling me about. I feel like I'm missing out now. Five hundred copper is like two thousand five hundred pixels, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Ken Debbie. Sorry, mate. How you doing, buddy? Welcome back, mate. How's your PS4 hanging on? You playing anything new on it, mate? Or are you just uh, tinkering about on the old War Thunder? I'll tell you what, playing War Thunder after playing at such a sort of pixelated game as this is going to be uh, just amazing. I'm, I'm still really impressed with the lighting in War Thunder. Some very, very nice games to look at. And you know, it's nothing overly fancy. You know, it's not like it's doing anything we've not seen before, but uh, it just works really well for the game, doesn't it? Oh shit, shit, why did I do, why did I do that? Dumb ass. Keep you blocked in my, oh. X, 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 X. Huh, that's weird. I don't care about cheesing. I think it's about the only way to play the game right now. Yeah, I think what I'll do is I'll pick up as many pixels as I can and just have a bit of a mining expedition down on this planet. Then I'll go and refine a load of my copper, for example, like you say, Mr. Stabby. Go and get myself a good batch of, what do we need, gold armour and gold weapons. And see how we get on then. Actually, you know what, I just realised I actually don't know what the objective of Gamma Sector is. It was quite obvious I needed to build a robot in the beta sector. Hmm, I do need to go and check that out when I'm back on the ship. Because obviously we're third boss. Does anyone know at this point in the game how many bosses there are? I don't, I've got no idea. Right, check that lot out. That's cool. I like the way the lantern still works underwater. That's it's worth its weight in gold in that uh, sense. Oh, oh, we're getting hungry again. Uh, oh, I've already got a hot keyed. 
Someone said earlier that um, you don't need to put them into your hot bars to use them. So how would I use my cooked slabs? Because I can't press E over it. My cooked meat, sorry, not my cooked slabs. Left click picks it up and right click um, just splits the stack in half. So how do you use an item in your inventory without putting it onto one of your 10 hotkeys? If anyone can tell me that I would really appreciate it. Someone mentioned it earlier. Five, there's only 5 bosses, oh wow. At this point, obviously. As we know there will be lots more. I suppose technically a game like this I could just keep uh, adding to it pretty much indefinitely really couldn't they? Whether or not they can keep it fun is a completely different matter though. See in a way I think one of the things that the game has lost which I, I really enjoyed in Terraria was in this game you tend not to have well at least put it this way at this point that I'm at, there doesn't seem to be any real incentive to have a base. Your base very much is your starship. Whereas in Terraria, you know, you could actually build a home, couldn't you? Which I kind of like that. I spent hours building, you know, my base as such. Maybe it comes later on. I do want to have a look at me, and I quite fancy visiting one of these space stations that people have been mentioning. Four hundred and twenty pixels. That's not a lot, is it? Oh wow. Uh. Mm. That didn't work out. Oh, bugger. Didn't mean to do that at all. Shit. Not going to be able to get at him now, am I? Oh. Spoke to. Oh my god! I am actually out of bandages now as well. Uh, tell me I can make me. Oh, thank God for that. <laughs> He's got his head stuck. <laughs> that happens every now and again. <laughs> I'm guessing it's sort of intentional. <laughs> Seen that stuff he's spitting out? That's ridiculous. That is just the stuff of nightmares. Where did the bandages go? Oh, there they are. Hello, ninja. Pick them up and click outside of your inventory. Ah, that's a good idea. So if I left click... Ah, yes. Nice one, mate. Nice one. Cheers, Mr. Stabby, once again. You know you're uh, starbound, dude. Yeah, I thought that was going to happen. So come back where your mate was. Keep pressing C instead of X.